like we are here. Well guys, we are back in seven days to die. Have not been here in a very long time. Not sure when the last time I did a video with seven days to die. I think it was with my friends, the Gen X team, and that was modded. But this is Alpha 21, and I have really no idea what all they've changed. Just wanted to jump in here, kind of be a little bit surprised. Probably going to get my hat butt handed to me. I was about to say something else. Handed to me. And uh, anyway, it says, Dear friend, the wasteland can be an unforgiving place. I found you naked and left for dead with no supplies. It looks like you crossed the Duke in a bad way and you could use some help. Enclosed is a short guide to help you survive. If you complete it, we might just met... We just might take in a new citizen. The White River Settlement, it's real and it's safe. Peace be with you, your friend, Noah. Okay, we're into the basic survival part of this, guys. So, all right. Well, guys, I tell you, I went ahead and started off in Navasgani, primarily because I'm familiar with this area, obviously. I've been playing this game literally since it came out since the pre-alpha actually I've been watching it since Paul Soros Jr. first introduced it way back in I think 2014 maybe in even 2013 and I was one of the first people to start putting videos out on it I even had played on a server with uh, was his name Cage <laughs> He's a pretty nice guy, but at that time, we were all brand new into this thing. Home Cooking Weekly. So we've got a new look. Looks like the graphics have improved quite a bit. Even, I mean, that's saying something. You should have seen the graphics back then. Holy crikeys. Compared to now, it was pretty, pretty bad. <laughs> but at the time, it was still cool. The whole... The whole thing about it was pretty cool. We got some worn boots, which we may want to wear. Because I'm having a feeling. Probably also want to read these. That way I'll save our inventory. Oh wow, they have really gotten a lot. Look at that. Even the cars have gotten more detailed, but I can't get anything out of this one. This is just a wreck. Let's see. Well, let's grab the rocks. I'm not taking the brass just yet. And I'll take the iron. Why am I not... Oh, that's weird. Huh. Double clicking doesn't allow you to move it. See, left click to inspect an item. Drop or swap a stack. Hold. I don't want to take everything. Well, you used to double click it and it just would work, but it's not working now for some reason. That's weird. I don't know, maybe it's my mouse settings because it says it should work. Also, you got to remember, this is an experimental version, so things may not work as well as they should. Okay, looks like we've got to go to the crafting menu, which i got to remember how to do. Believe it or not, as much as I've played this, I've put over... 2,000 hours into this game. Let's see. Looks like the crafting menu. We need to make a bedroll. Oh, 
that looks different. Yes, and we can make it any color we choose, but for now I'm just going to go ahead and do what I'm supposed to do. Let's place it. Okay, craft a stone axe. Should have all the ingredients for that. And we're going to need it. Put that in there. Well, we got to craft fiber pants. Where are the fiber pants? And gather wood. Okay, so now we got to gather some wood. Now, right now, we're not going to get any zombies for just a little bit. It's kind of like a safe zone. And they still have this little thing where you, they mark where you can find things. I'm just going to go ahead and take a whole tree down. I'm already noticing some differences in the sounds and the look and feel of some things. But everything else seems pretty familiar. Little pictures down there, some of them have changed. Alright, let's see. We need to gra see, gather wood, make a wooden club. That's all the same. Whoa, I think I dropped my club. I did. Okay, from the no that's the Duke of Navasgani. The Duke of Navasgani to find resources. Okay, let's get some feathers. At least R still works. I don't know if I want to get that much wood. I can do this with my fists. Says wear and tear on my tools. Cotton. Okay, what is next? Primitive bow and arrow, alright. I think I can only make two arrows though, but... Okay, I'm going to move that over. So, three. Oh wow, that really looks like a <laughs> real primitive bow and arrow. I mean, geez. Okay, let's see here, guys. Uh, okay, we got to do the building block thing, so we need probably some more wood. I need to get some more nests, too. Probably be best. I don't want to stray too far, because I'll start finding zombies. They've had some interesting ambient sounds and music now. The music has changed. Oh wow, check it out. All kinds of goodies. Let's see, we've got Explosive Magazine, Shotgun Weekly. Yeah, since we're by ourselves, we might as well read it. Normally, when I play with other people, we save them and we make sure everybody has at least had a chance to look and see if they've had it or got it. We also usually add a mod so that we can craft craft the books. Huh, the nest disappears. That's different. Usually the nest just stays there. That's completely different. So what happens when you run out of nests? There's a good question. <laughs> You run out of nests, you run out of, well, you don't necessarily run out of feathers, but you can get them from a few other sources, but we'll, we'll guess we'll see what happens. You know, chickens and zombie vultures. That's been a good way to get some, some rocks. There's another nest that blows my mind and it disappears. Huh. Well, I don't want to push my luck here. I am going to go ahead and build a block, but I think what I'll do is I'll do this as a at the beginning so that I can kind of know that this is my spawn end point. 
craft. Okay, that's pretty much the same. Now we should be able to upgrade it. I gotta craft a campfire. I always like the beginning of these though. It, it's kind of like the beginning of Minecraft with the punching of the wood. And that's traditional to put the campfire up there. Good job, survivor. You have proved to be a capable to be capable with much potential. We have marked your map with the nearest White River outpost location. There you will find a trader where you can buy and sell goods and trade stories with one of our friendly citizens. Welcome aboard, Noah. Alright. Well that's a quite a distance, honestly. So it's that's the closest. Jeez. Yeah, I'm trying to remember Ooh, I've got me a zombie over there. Be my first one. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and check this. Man, they really have improved the graphics. Look at this. This is incredible looking. They got the broke down porch now. Oh wow. Okay, I better be ready. Could be things in here. Mean nasty things. Wow, the graphics have so improved. Okay, we got Oh shoot. Yeek. It's Edgar! Yeah, Bunny and Possum named him. Our good old friendly Edgar. Ooh, it took his... No, I thought it took his hate off. Yeah, it did take his hate off. Just the top part of his hate. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I didn't quite expect there to be zombies in here since I was kind of in a... Oh, there it goes. Why wasn't it working earlier? Now it's working. That's kind of strange. Yeah, you sh you, if, if you hit shift and double click on it, it should go right into your into your menu, and it didn't do that for the last time. I like the double door thing. That's pretty cool. I don't know what you could do with it, but it's still pretty cool. Wait a minute, there's a microwave. Got animal fat in there. Just make some candles. Aha! I knew it. There's always... Yeah, I need a block pick. Yeah, we're gonna need to break this down. Better get our club ready. Could have a zombie taking a bath. Let's see. Ooh, the medicine cabinet looks elaborate. Look at all that. EPA and <laughs> Okay, we got all kinds of good stuff in here. Alright, we're gonna head and read that. That way we get it out of our inventory and we get it into our little memories. Wow! Neat! <laughs> we're finding all kinds of good loots here. All kinds of good loots. Oh, shoot. Gotta be careful. Got floor issues. This place is a mess. Yeah, I love the way they've done the trash piles. It looks more realistic, like you would actually see in a real place. Oh, jeez. We've got issues. Get down and stay hell down. There you go. Creep. Anything in the wooden desk. Sewing kit. Uh, nothing here. None of those open. Damn. The armoire does open. I've got a shirt that I can wear. That reminds me, what do I look like here? Is it, uh, wait a minute, is it tab? Yeah. 
I'm looking a little rough, but it's my same character for, that I've been playing. The gray hair and everything. Let's see if I've got some skill points to say. I've got four available. So it's probably a good idea that I spend some of them. Probably need to do some endurance or agility here. Let's see. Not Parker. Deep cuts. Run and gun. Huh. Well, that's not exactly what I thought it was. Healing factor. Intellect. Well, let's do lock picking for sure. Because we've already run into that situation. Let's see. They don't have a. Uh, sexual Tyrannosaurus anymore. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, they don't. They've removed some of them. I don't know if that's good or bad. Maybe it's good. Well, let's put one in archery. Infiltrator, the penetrator, dead eye. Let's see here. Running gun, Parker. Well, I'm not really sure where to apply some of these just yet. Ah, definitely. That's going to help. Cardio. Want to have the, uh, you know, the stamina. Need the staminas. Probably wouldn't hurt to have a brawling capability since I'm doing a lot of my fists, you know, using my fists for a lot of things here. But yeah, they have changed some things already. I can definitely see that. I can't believe they got rid of the sexual Tyrannosaurus. That's been there for a long time. Always under the strength. Let's see. Anything in here? Oh, here I check there. Okay. I think we have scavenged this as much as we can at this point. Yeah, doesn't look like there's anything else here. Huh. Well, that's interesting. That's one of those things where you can plant, I think. Let's see here. We need to... Repair that. I'm going to repair that. Alright, I am not sure where I am exactly, but I will figure it out. A lot of Navasgani has changed. I'm sure they've changed it yet again, but probably heading for the trader would be a good, smart thing to do. It's not that late yet, so we can kind of open up the map a little bit, grab some stuff as we go. stones and such. Aha! We have a structure. Jimbo's. Worms for you? <laughs> what the heck? Is this the... Is this the thing that's on the dock or something? Dude! Oh, you gotta punch it on me, you little... Mm. Mm. He was the original spider zombie. Until he made their changes. Business suit, dude. Yeah, they don't offer any thing to take off of them anymore. Wow, 
I imagine the detail on some of these things. Okay, I was getting ready to say, some of these don't have anything in them. Okay. Well, I don't know that I need that just yet, but... Yeah, this is the thing that's on the, the dock, or whatever you call it. Destroyed workbench? Boy, look how realistic that looks. It looks destroyed. <laughs> Man, the level of detail. So stepped up. Yes, this is definitely it. Can't get to it from that side. We got a zombie over there. Alright. Yeah, I did get hit. Down a few points, but not not too bad. Ooh. Okay, they got that blocked. Can't unlock it. Let's see, can we... Can't lock... Un can't pick it. Don't have any picks. Okay, let's see if it's on the dock, at least. Looks like we got us a boat here. I wonder if they've improved the water. The water has always been kind of screwed up for... Holy crap! Where the... Ah! Damn it! Damn zomb zombie vulture! Ah, uh, shit. Ah! Seriously? Holy crap, that didn't take long. Boy, he, uh, did me some damage. Shoot. That was fast. <laughs> that was fast. Uh, well, let's... Oh! Spawn near my backpack. I, I like that. That's new. That is new. Holy crap, that's new. I don't have to... That is cool. I like that. That is really nice to have. Now, I had killed him, but not before. I didn't have a chance to get to my bandage. And I bled out. You pain in the butt. Use door. Oh, cool. Ah, got me a shirt. Better shirt. We'll scrap that one. Uh, I don't really want to get overburdened just yet. Let's see. Dang on it. I keep forgetting the... Yeah, I don't really want the lead just yet. Or the or the zombie flesh. It's like these little hidden caches. Okay, we got a zombie somewhere close. Another sports bag. Where is he? And he is mad. Oh, he's under the water. Sucks to be you. All right. <laughs> That's interesting. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. We're getting to we're running out of time here. And I want to see... Looks like the water's improved. Just seeing what's under the bottom of the lake. Yeah, we got to we got to get someplace soon. It is 3.50. I mean, it's not super, super late, but... 
Takes a lot of energy to swim. Okay. Yeah, I kept running out of stamina. Stamina's. Okay, we gotta get up this hill. Oh wow. That's a long way. And there's a. Oh, there's a structure out there too. That's pretty cool. Okay, I need to get down here and carefully so I don't hurt myself. Yeah, that would be a good place to hole up. Yeah, the other thing is, is as you run out of stamina, you sink. <laughs> stamina real fast in water. As most people do. Okay. Okay, there's a zombie over there. I'm not engaging at this point. I want to kind of get to some kind of a semi-safe zone. Well, that's cool looking. They got all kinds of cool little things around here. Yeah, let's just get to where we're supposed to be first. That's not going to offer us much protection through the night. Yeah, and this isn't a big world either. This is like half the size of the, I think, the maximum. Yeah, I might want to go ahead and craft some more arrows. There we go. At least I have something to shoot from a distance instead of having a hit him head on. Let's see. It's just a random trailer. It's... Mabel! Mabel! Ooh, Mabel, you are mean. Well, she punched me, but I took her head. Oh, there's her head! Oh my god! I actually knocked her head off. <laughs> Talk about knocking your block off. I mean, good lord. Ooh, that's disgusting. We got some fire. I'm not gonna assume that. I want to assume it can hurt me. Yep. They actually show people that have been attacked and killed. Wow. Damn, this looks cool. That doesn't. Hello. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. I want to get a headshot. But he keeps moving. There we go. Ah, right in the head. That's why I wanted to get my stone arrow back. Damn it. Okay, let's see here. I like this. This is you can hear the refrigerator running. There's some corn that we could plant or eat. See what's in the cabinet. Got some more iron scraps. Pile of books. Ooh.
That's cool. Pile of food. Whoop. Well, that's a... They've really gotten so amazingly... I mean, the, I can't even express how real this looks. Jeez. Okay, let's see here. Anything behind there? No. I think there's something. Yep, there's something up in there. Antibiotics. Man, this looks like a real trailer, for Christ's sake. I mean, really, it does. Man. Oh, wow. Alright, just some rotten meat. Microwave doesn't work. Nothing in that. That's pretty cool. I've noticed a lot of random things through here. All these guys are mean. I hate when their heads sway, because then it's like it always sways the wrong way. And he sways a lot. Man, he's tough. There we go. Get all my arrows. <laughs> so I wish the arrows would go and stick somewhere so you could pick them up too. Where's that marker? Okay, there it is. Alright. So where am I headed to? Am I headed to a town or am I headed to just a structure outside of town? Guess I'll find out soon enough. Yeah, so far guys, I'm really liking this. I am really liking this. It's not overly tough, honestly. At least I'm not seeing it. I did bump up my loot levels a little bit, but that's because I'm single player. So you're going to see a little more loot than you would in just straight vanilla default. But let me tell you, you need all the help you can get when you first start out by yourself. So it's up to you whether you want to do that or not. Used to be hunting these stumps, that's why I'm checking them. Not sure they still have it, but it's worth a look. If nothing else, I'm going to get wood. Okay, so I think it's going to be just a structure. Yeah, it is. And it was almost too late to be able to go in it. Okay, this is not going to be the girl. But it looks like you can get... Ah, you can't get them. Ah, oh, that sucks. Yeah, I don't think this is going to be the girl. This is going to be one of the guys. I like the girl. The girl's actually easy on the eyes. Okay, so this is actual, actually Trader Joel. Let's see. May I see your inventory? So he's got nothing much that I could really use except maybe this padded armor, but that, he, he's got a lot of money for him, and I have none, so... <laughs> Might as well ask him if he's got any jobs. So we can clear zombies, we can fetch... This one's not too far. For someone of your talents. Yeah, he's not the one that's real I rude. Thank you enough, friend. Yeah, he's pretty nice. He's a nice guy. Whoops. Alright. See, we can get everything we need right here, guys, just by reading them. If 
I've unlocked food. I've done all kinds of good stuff. Let's see here. Rifle world. I need to find some place to stay, and I can't stay here. Gonna have to leave, but I did complete that. Okay, here's the exit. So what do we got on the map here? Anything nearby? Besides a zombie, because I can hear it running, running over here. Ooh, that looks like the wasteland. That's not a good idea. All right, guys. It's uh, yeah, it's getting late, and we need we need to get ourselves holed up somewhere. Well, that trailer was about the closest place I can come up with. And it was secured. So let's head to that. Because at 20... 100 hours, we are going to be dealing with zombies that can run. So... I do not like to be out in the middle of the night with zombies on the loose. It's not cool. Yeah, this doesn't look like Navasgani at all anymore. This has changed so much. Okay, I need to go this way towards the sun. Alright. Don't let the sun go down on me. Yeah, we don't want the sun to go down on us. That's not cool. The sun goes down, the zombies start running. Yeah, years ago, it used to be that the zombies just came in waves at night and were relentless. I wasn't too far. I can use that too. Okay, we're a little overburdened now, but not too bad. All right, well, this is as good as anything, honestly. Shady Slaughter RV. <laughs> yeah, we didn't check the vehicle, did we? No. Let's check the SUV. Now they have SUVs in the game. Pretty cool. Okay, we got. Oh, we got us a stone shovel. And some t a wheel and some nails. And some luggage here. Ooh, got us a hoodie. Let's see, what does that offer here? Well, it's good for cold resistance. Bad for heat, but we're not in a hot zone, so. Now let's go with that for now. Let's see if there's anything else that we can use around here. Oh, it's 2200 hours. I'm sorry, not 20. 2200 hours and all heck breaks loose. Let's see. I don't know how much protection that's going to offer, but it's better than nothing. That's a nice little comfort area there. Yeah, we just have some... Just curious what that was. Alright. Well, let's stick close to this, guys, and see what we can do about... getting out and finding something a little more permanent. Let's see, we've got, already got a bunch of stuff. But we can put some of the stuff in some of these areas here, like the cupboards. Let's see, let's drop off this. We don't really need this right at the moment. Coffee, acid, animal fat, brass radiator, paper, cotton. Bones. Well, actually, the bone we could convert that into a shiv. Uh, pine seed, the note, 
while the wheel would be useful. Oh, there we go. Forgot about being able to sort. That's going to make a difference. The shovel could come in handy. Go ahead and repair that. We're going to repair this. Repair everything we have. That way we're... Alright, I'm going to go ahead and close this door behind me because I'd rather not be surprised, if at all possible. Let me see here. Let's see if we got any more points to divvy out. Yeah, we do. And we need to do something into tools. So we've got the crafting here. We've got spears, got handguns, stone tools, iron tools. So we got to get that skill up. I th let's see. Heart reading tools digest will increase the quality of crafted harvesting tools, boost loot odds. 49er. Hmm. Pack mule. That might not be a bad thing to, to add to it. But let me see. It's under intellect is where it used to be. Yep. Advanced engineering. Probably a good one to work with. What is it? Sound. get some coal out of this. Yep. I see this could be a useful place to stay too, just up, uh, up on top of this trailer. Things get really ugly. In fact, Yeah, I don't think we can climb through that. Alright, pick up the camping chair. Just pick up the small stone. Yeah, we're getting close to it. the end here, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a little more wood. Side, guys. It is time. All right. Sounds like we got us some company. Somebody's wandering about. know if the zombies can see through glass or not. Yeah, you can't place a torch anymore. Huh. Yep, you sure can't. Oh yeah, you can. I guess you have to have enough space. Well, he definitely knows the torch is there. <laughs> so he's going to smack on the car. 
the hell's wrong with you, dude? <laughs> I was going to say, that thing's going to blow up. Well, he's persistent, I'll give him that. Yeah, see if I had an access way to the roof, I would jump up there and shoot him in the face. What is he beating on? The car? <laughs> or the trailer? If I can sneak up on him, what is he? I'm just trying to see what he's beating on. He can't see me. Well, I got rid of that troublemaker. That was probably a little risky, but it was fun. <laughs> yeah, I think he was just beating on the trailer, but the trailer seemed to be holding up pretty good. Yeah, I think I must have alerted him when I had the torch, so they do see it through glass. I don't know if this light does anything to attract them. Hard to say. Well guys, I tell you what, I think the best thing I can do is hunker down. Let's get back in the back here. This should be fairly safe. And we just need to Stay put and be quiet and hopefully we'll get through the night okay. But anyway, guys, wait a minute, there's a... Ah, nothing. I was just checking. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this first look at 7 Days to Die Alpha 21 Experimental. Let me know, guys, if you want me to continue. I am... I have no problems playing this game. I love playing this game, actually. Uh, I was hoping that maybe people would take a little bit of an interest in it so I can get back into doing this again but anyway guys as I always say aim straight cast far and have fun I will see you later bye bye don't let the sun set down on me don't let the sun sit down on me no food or water, maybe seven days until I die. The bombs are falling, there was fire burning in the sky. The dead have risen, and I don't know why. Help me, O oh great spirit in the sky. Don't let the sun set down on me. Don't let the